Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. So let's say, just for argument's sake, that you've got a PC. And uh, you've got the PC sitting there, but you don't have a monitor plugged into it, you don't have a keyboard plugged into it, and you don't have a mouse plugged into it. But you do happen to have a notebook computer that is running Windows as well. You could turn that notebook computer, that laptop, into uh, the controlling mechanism for your PC. Uh, you might use software to do this, or here's an idea, use software that's built into this, a KVM that was designed for portability and specifically a laptop. All you need is an open USB port on either machine. Let me see here, there we go. It's plugged into the laptop there, and then this USB cable, uh, the other part of it goes into the PC. You install the software and you're off to the races. It's only Windows compatible, but again, just think about that. Not only are you saving energy by not having an extra monitor lying around, and not only are you saving space by not having the keyboard and the mouse around, but uh, you're potentially saving yourself some time. Uh, using a KVM is extremely recommended if you have more than one computer lying around. This particular device was made by IO Gear. If you'd like to get your own laptop KVM, head to go.tagjag.com slash IOKVM. So now we're going to shorten that one. Go.tagjag.com slash IOKVM. Keyboard, mouse, video. Actually, that was KMV. Keyboard, video, mouse. That's, that's what KVM stands for, in case you didn't know. Uh, it comes with everything you need, the software, the hardware. In fact, what's interesting about what uh, IO Gear did is they've got an extra USB port here, right in the middle. And this is designed so that you can plug any external hard drive into the IO Gear laptop KVM and then use it as an interim. So you can transfer files back and forth between uh, either your, your notebook computer, your laptop, and that PC that you plugged it into, or an external hard drive. Huh? So it's uh, quite handy uh, to have around, again, so long as you're using uh, Windows on, on all those machines. I'm looking here to see if there's anything that I'm missing. Not really. Uh, it's easy to uh, switch between uh, the configurations. Of course, your notebook computer is going to act as your video, your keyboard, and your mouse. You don't need to plug anything into that PC. And why would you not have a monitor or keyboard or mouse plugged into that PC? Well, for a variety of reasons. One, you're trying to save space uh, or... Two, maybe it's nothing more than a file server of sorts that you don't need to have a monitor plugged in all the time. But when you do need to plug in that monitor, what are you going to do? You're going to haul out the monitor and plug it in? No. You'd want to use something like a KVM or connect to that computer uh, by way of VNC or some kind of remote desktop. That's what most geeks might do. But as I said, the advantage of the IO Gear laptop KVM, that's what they're branding it. That's what they're calling it. Yes, the laptop KVM. Uh, is that you can plug in an external hard drive and connect the notebook, the PC, and that external hard drive. So it's just another piece of hardware uh, that you can carry with you. Uh, all you need is open USB ports, Windows PCs. You know, you could use another Windows PC if you wanted to and, and connect it by way of this KVM if you wanted to. It's fine, but I, I know that a lot of people out there have notebook computers already, so they've got the screens, uh, and they may have a PC lying around. So it's just another option for you to consider if you never thought about getting uh, some kind of KVM switch at all. Yes, there are a lot of abbreviations, but hey, that's what geeks are good for. Thanks to IO Gear for passing this along. Hopefully, well, with any luck, they'll uh, give me other products uh, to be able to review or share those solutions with the rest of you. Again, go.tagjag.com slash IOKVM. I think that's about all. Now, maybe you know of another KVM solution? Another piece of hardware, a gadget that you can't live without? Feel free to make the recommendation. My email address is chris at perillo.com. I take anything you got to send me. And you know you can make other recommendations at, where's the community? That's right, geeks.perillo.com. Yes, I know, we're at youtube.com slash locker gnome, twitter.com slash chris perillo. I'm floating around the web. Now, if you want to stick with the chat room, you're more than welcome to. We're typically talking tech. 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, even if I'm not here. Maybe I'm floating elsewhere. Chat room is alive and a part of this live video experience at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.